Hi, this is the continuation of a series of videos designed to give individuals information that they can use to prepare for a visit to a physician's office. The videos are designed to help ensure that the individual can ask appropriate questions of the physician and to increase the likelihood that quality care is delivered. Itchy skin, also called puritis, can be accompanied by a rash or just present on its own. It can be localized to a specific area or be a general body itchiness. It can be acute or chronic. Chronic itch that cannot be relieved can be intolerable. It can make an individual so anguished that they have been known to contemplate suicide. So the word itch does not bring to mind serious problems to most of us, but it can be serious and should not be discounted. The physician will want to determine if the itchiness is a manifestation of skin disease or if it is a manifestation of a deeper systemic illness or if there is a psychological component to the symptoms. The physician will take a complete history concerning the itch before starting the physical examination. The physician will want to know when it started, its duration, anything that makes it worse, anything that relieves it, and its location or locations. The physician will ask questions such as, have you had this itch condition before? If so, when? How was it treated? Was the treatment successful? Have you been exposed to any chemical agents recently? Have you been working out in the yard or hiking outdoors recently? Have you been out of the country lately? Do you have allergies to environmental allergens? If yes, which ones? Have you been more tired than normal lately? Have you lost weight lately? What medications do you currently take? Does the itching occur after taking a bath? If so, what type of soap do you use during bathing? The physical exam will primarily consist of inspection and palpation of the area of the skin with the symptoms. The physician will be looking for scratch marks, areas of dry skin and insect bites. The physician will also be looking for indications on the skin that point to the burrows formed by scabies, a mite that can infest the skin. The physician will be looking for reddened or raised areas of the skin. The physician will also be looking for indications of lice infestation. Lice, either head lice or body lice, can cause itchiness. It is a result of an allergic reaction to the saliva of the lice. The physician will also be looking for any secondary bacterial infection, which may be a complication of scabies or lice infestations. The physician will be trying to determine if the itchiness is caused by a common cause of itchiness, such as dry skin, which may be more evident in the elderly, particularly during the winter months. Urticaria, also known as hives, which consists of red bumps or plaques, also called wheels, on the skin that appear suddenly either as a result of the body's reaction to certain allergens or for unknown reasons. Atopic dermatitis, a hereditary cause of dry, itchy skin. Scabies, again an infestation of the skin by a mite. Pediculosis, again an infestation of the hair or body by lice. Contact dermatitis. Contact dermatitis is a red, itchy rash caused by direct contact with a substance or an allergic reaction to it. Insect bites. Lichen planus. Lichen planus is an inflammatory condition that can affect the skin, hair, nails, and mucous membranes. On the skin, lichen planus usually appears as purplish, often itchy, flat top bumps. The physician will also be looking for fungal infections of localized areas of the body. The physician will want to ensure that any systemic causes of the itchiness are not missed. Disorders such as cancer from Hodgkin's lymphoma 
or leukemia can cause itchy skin. Chronic renal failure or gallbladder problems can cause itchy skin. Infections by parasites can cause itchy skin. It is likely that the physician will be able to make a diagnosis without a need for initially ordering any investigative studies. The physician will treat the patient initially. Later, the physician may decide to order the following tests. A urinalysis, a pregnancy test, renal function tests, liver function tests, blood sugar levels, a chest x-ray, a biopsy of the skin lesions, and stool for ova and parasites. In the next video, we will discuss the more common causes of itchy skin and treatment in more detail. Well, I hope this helps. Have a good day.